Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing my June favorites, and I have a lot of favorites this month, and I have to keep this video under 10 minutes, so I'm trying, if I talk really fast, it's just because um, it has to be under 10 minutes, so yeah, let's get started. Okay, so my first favorite for this month is the Tresemme Fresh Start Dry Shampoo, and I have been looking for a dry shampoo for a really long time, and I heard about this one here on YouTube, and a lot of people were saying that they really liked it, so I went out and got it, and um, I have to say, I don't love it, but I think it's okay, and I like it. Um, basically, what a dry shampoo is, is you spray it in your hair um, when you feel that your hair is a little greasy. And um, this one, I feel, doesn't really soak up all the oil. I think it gets rid of some of it, but it's not like, bam, fresh washed hair. But, you know, it's okay, and um, it does the job. This is the Neutrogena Ultra Sear Dry Touch Sunblock, and um, this is SPF 55. And this is a face sunblock um, because I went on vacation last month and my face got really burnt and I was just like I need a face sunblock if I go anywhere so I got this one and I tried it out love it it does not make me break out at all it's oil free it won't clog your pores and it's waterproof and sweat proof and it's great next favorite this month is bio oil and um, I got this because I saw a commercial on TV that you know it got rid of stretch marks and I don't really think it's a big deal for me to say that I have stretch marks because I don't think I'm the only person to have stretch marks so um yeah not really a big deal uh but yeah I've had this for a whole month and I haven't even used like hardly any and basically it says that it helps fade stretch marks and all this other stuff so um I don't know, I haven't really seen any results, but I'm going to keep on using it. Um, they definitely have faded a little, but they're still there. Mm -hmm. The Evian Facial Spray, and basically um, I got this because it's summer, and if my face starts to feel really hot and I just need to cool off, I can spray this. And it also says it moisturizes, it refreshes, and tones your face. And um, I really like it, and it definitely does refresh my face and sort of sets my makeup the benefit to go stay put set and I absolutely love these sets they're only ten dollars I have the other set that benefit came out with before um but now I got this one and I absolutely love it it comes with their stay don't stray eye primer um their erase paste concealer and then one of their creaseless cream shadows um and it's just great because you get to try out benefits products and see if you like them, and it's only $10. Which probably has to be my favorite thing that I got this month is my NARS Sheer Glow Foundation. I've been wanting this foundation for forever, and I finally got it, and I love it. It stays on forever. It's awesome. It looks great. Um, and I'm in color Punjab, but I love, love this foundation. Um, next, I got another foundation this month. I saw it. And I was like, oh my gosh, I really want that. Um, Maybelline came out with a new foundation. It's called the Maybelline Dream Smooth Mousse Foundation. Um, not the Maybelline Dream Matte, the Maybelline Dream Smooth. And it looks like this. And this one's different because you can, you know, lift it up. And they give you a little sponge, but I don't use that. Um, and then you twist it and you get your product. And it basically looks like this. It's just like a mousse um, foundation. I tried it out and I love it. It gives you sort of like a dewy, natural finish. Um, I have to set it with powder because I have oily skin, but I love it. It's great for summer. Okay, so my next favorite for this month is the Palladio Herbal Foundation Primer. And I actually heard this about this um, from the beauty broadcast. And I got it and it definitely is a little bit like Smashbox Bono Finish. I tried that one out in my hand on Sephora. So smooth, so silky. This one is pretty much like that for half the price. Love it. Amazing Cosmetics, amazing concealer. This is great coverage. It covers so well. Um, I really do love it, and um, it's just a really great concealer. This is my first MAC shadow ever. It's All That Glitters, and it looks like this. Awesome all over lid color. It's such a pretty, like, um, just, like, the most gorgeous color ever. I love this color. It's great for all over lid, great for summer, shimmery, gorgeous, love it. Next is a new mascara, and it's the Maybelline the False, Maybelline the Falsies Volume Express Mascara, 
and I actually got this because I was looking around Walmart and I really needed a new one. Um, the brush is really weird. It sort of is like tilted and it has like flat side here and then here it sort of sticks out. Um, I don't know. I don't really find that it's like that great, but I think it's okay. It does sort of make my lashes really long, but it doesn't really separate them that great. They sort of clump. Um, but it's good. I like it. Next is the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. Love this. I actually had a sample of it before. Loved it. Got the full size. Love it even more. My shadow stamp ever. This is a brush and um, this is the Sigma SS188 brush and it's sort of smaller than the what 187 I believe. Um, it's a lot smaller and it's a stippling brush. I basically use it to stipple on blush and um, I really like that. Awesome brush. Um, these are the two MAC to the Beach lipsticks. This one's in Beach Bound, which is like a creamsicle color. Really pretty. Love it for summer. Um, next is MAC's Lazy Day lipstick. Love this one. This is like my favorite pink that I have. Um, next are these two Maybelline, the Pearls collection that Maybelline came out with. Um, this one's in Twinkle. These are very, very pearly and frosty, but I think they look good on me. Maybe not on some people, but I think they look fine on me. Um, this one's in Twinkle. It's like a very shimmery, frosty baby pink. Um, and I really like that color. And then this one is so pearly, which is like a nudish white color. I think it looks good on me. Um, I don't really think they look crazy on my lips, but I really like them. Next is the Matte to the Beach Lip Glass in Easy Lounger, and this color goes absolutely amazing with um, Beach Bound, which is that creamsicle color. So pretty, so summery and pink and shimmery, and I love it. Next are these two Jordina lip liners. These I actually got at Walgreens. They were in like a box with all these other discounted makeup. These I think were like 79 cents each, so I of course had to get one. Um, I got this one in Baby Dreams, which is a pink. And then I got this one in Hot Pepper, which is a red, because you never know when you might need a red lip liner. Um, so yeah, got that. And um, the last two things I have to show you are nail polishes. Um, they're both China Glaze. This one is That Away, and it's like an orangey coral, really pretty. It has some gold like reflex in it. And then this one is Secret Periwinkle, and it's like a um, creamy blue, um, like a midnight blue, really pretty. So yeah, that's pretty much it that I have to show you guys. Um, I can't believe that it's already July and my birthday is coming up. I'm so excited. Yay! Um, so yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.